Welcome to the chat, people. Welcome to Channel 48. My name is Puck, and thank you for tuning in on this Friday evening. Uh, today, we're going to take a look at some of my BlackBerry devices that I grabbed out of the bag yesterday and start charging them. I'm here with the BlackBerry Playbook with the set 10, and I even have some other models. I'm not sure what this model is called. And I even have the Classic, and the Classic uh, died. Well, it did not die. It, it went updating out of itself yesterday. And now I'm in a screen where I'm connected to my internet. But the next button is not popping up because, yeah, BlackBerry closed the servers. So that update had not, should not have been installed, but it installed fully automatic. So a uh, request to BlackBerry. Um, if I contact you, can you please unlock this phone so I can bypass? Because I'm missing this phone already. It's my personal recorder if I go to the studio. Because these phones, they record really, really, really good. They as well play music really, really, really good. The digital analog converter in these devices are just like wow. As well on the BlackBerry Playbook. Really. So... Uh, Let's go take a look at these devices. This is a very long video, but we are in the chat. Feel free to, to type uh, and to introduce yourself, uh, to tell us about your BlackBerry devices, if you still have one or whatsoever you know about BlackBerry. Um, just pop in, feel free to chat. Uh, so let's get started and let's go do it. <music> Welcome to channel 48. What you're looking at is my Blackberry playbook. I just grabbed it out of the bag, put it on the cradle. I got this uh, second Blackberry playbook. Um, I think one or two years ago. And um, I got it really cheap. I think I paid 15 euros for it or so. And I as well had another one, but I could not use that one anymore because of the uh, port, the micro SD port is was molested. It was already molested when I, when I when I bought it, you know. Uh, but yeah, it got worse and I could not turn it on anymore. And thanks to this cradle, by popping it onto the cradle, uh, these these devices they have two uh, charging ports. So if one breaks, the other you know can still do the job. Um, yeah, only transferring files will be a little bit hard, but you can do it via Wi-Fi. Um, and I'm booting this device now uh, after we learned in the news that BlackBerry devices went on black. And I think a year ago I uh, made a video as well uh, how you could um, protect yourself in the future when BlackBerry is going to stop with it all. And uh, here we see that uh, we have a problem. Let me see if I can skip that. You see, I can skip that gladly. Yeah, she, I must, it keeps uh, asking that. Uh, but we are connected to the internet and uh, I will do that later. Come on, leave me alone. <laughs> Go away. Yeah, man. So uh, I already installed applications uh, in the past to protect me against uh, BlackBerry going down. And the problem will be that probably I cannot even log in to this account. Um, or maybe this is a local account because you cannot really connect to the BlackBerry servers anymore. Uh, that as well made me lo lose a phone yesterday that went updating out of nothing and now i'm stuck in a screen where it cannot continue uh, 
it's saying yeah the internet is 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 is, is not is not work uh, yeah, we are not connected to the internet and that is this blackberry here and i think that i might uh pass if i uh, put in a sim card with a 4g uh, mobile connection maybe the one from the phone that i'm using just temporary i will put it in so i can connect uh, and bypass that screen because uh, at this point this phone was working perfectly fine yesterday uh, but it went updating out of itself and then yeah it came into uh, the setup screen and i could not bypass the wi-fi uh, it's it's connected but it cannot uh, yeah it's, it's just not bypassing uh, the next button is not coming up so um I don't know how I will fix that because this is a very beautiful uh, device. It's the classic, you know, I have it uh, a while already. Got it from a marketplace friend that I was uh, helping with fixing phones and he just could not get rid of these phones. So he said, uh, you know, he gave me one for every repair that I did for other phones that he could sell. And uh, that's how I got my collection. In fact, I have a complete con collection of blackberry phones i had uh the the 10 the set 10 as well uh, for my for myself to play with and yeah i love that one because it can as well run android um so last year i made a video and tell, told you that two years ago blackberry would already stop uh uh yeah this complete uh device the support etc but the ceo de uh, decided to continue for two more years and two days or three days ago it happened and these devices went on black and uh, here we just see that in the connecting let me see if something is there can we still do something But this one, this one, this one, nothing. So I think this this app is not working anymore. Okay. How about the scanner radio? Top 50. The retrieving directory displays fine. We hear no sound because nobody's talking. This is very annoying. Nobody's talking, but it works. Um, top music. These things are as well very good recorders. Hold on, I'm gonna put you on the tripod. So there we are. Well, this one seems to open. Um, United Kingdom. Play me that song. I heard something. And then you can download the song. Can we still download it? Yes, we can. This is amazing. <laughs> Shut up. Yeah, boom. We just downloaded this song. Wow. Look at that music player. Beautiful. Beauty, 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 beautiful. 
so here so that means um we can still get our top 40 how do we do that yeah yeah so this is the uh, the top 50 from every country in the world that we can still get let me see netherlands what netherlands says On number one, Clean Bandit. Let me see what that is. Nice. So those that uh, followed my video in the past um, that I made about preparing yourself for when the time comes that, you know, it will all go away. Uh, they will still be able to do a whole lot of things uh, with their with their device. You see, I have even Dolphin Browser. And Dolphin Browser will let me... Uh, let me see if that works. US TV. Uh, go. Dot TV. Go. Let me see if this worky worky. Mm -hmm. Site is opening. Nice. Can I watch my CNN? Always nice to have a device like this beside your bed, you know, to play you CNN. I don't know if it's gonna work, maybe the browser is... No, no. No trabajo. Maybe another station. No. ACC network. Okay, this unfortunately is not working. Maybe with this browser, could be. TV though, yeah. What are you doing? TV. Go. Why is the fee not coming? Start. This one loads as well. Let's go for CNBC. This looks hopeful. Oh no. Oh no. Rash glad. This is so sad. This would be so nice for this device if it would still be able to do oh, fatal error oh. mon dieu ce ne travaille pas ouh la la oh no no okay so that is not possible anymore maybe I don't know, news tube, is that still working? News tube. What is this? 
just stupid links to how do we go back I don't know this is a stupid app the store uh, will not work anymore that you can forget about okay you see network is not available they cut off the network but the problem is as I was telling you with this device um, even though I'm connected to the internet I cannot hit next and then I so I cannot I cannot you see I'm connected look you see connected but the next is not popping up the next is not popping up There's no way to, to, to hit next. That while I'm connected, saying you need data connection to continue. Please connect to a Wi Fi network. I'm bloody connected. But you need a data connection. Is Wi Fi not a data connection? So probably I must just put in a SIM card with a data connection. Probably, right? And then I will be able to pass by. So I'm not so worried about that device anymore. Uh, about this device, um, I can say that I'm using this to um, watch to the scanner radio, but I as well use it uh, for music, to listen to music. And the most important thing is to make recordings. You can make amazing recordings with this device. It has a very good DAC built in. So connecting this to your amplifier will as well give you an amazing experience. And if you don't believe me, just try it. Just try it. Connect it with these cables. I will show you, we will make a little recording here. This is the recorder. Uh, this is just for voice testing one, two, three, four broadcasting. Voice testing one, two, three, four broadcasting. You hear that? The sound is just as good as the sound of my of my iPhone, for instance. And that is so many generations later. It's it's better than 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 all Samsung phones from S1 up to, I never tested S7, you know? So I will not say S7, but one to six, they are useless if it comes to recording loud music. Cause I have a band and if we were, would play, I would record my, my band, then these devices would do the best job, this and the Apple devices. And later the S8. The S8 as well records good. Because I made a whole lot of noise on the Samsung website in the past. And you all know I, I can say things in a, in a way that, you know, will trigger you not to do it anymore. This is uh, another uh, rehearsal room. And then I make recordings from my band. And uh, they sound amazing huh, when I come home. Nine years ago. Blackberry could already do that. You hear me what I say? So that is the story. So how do we go back? I never know how to go back with these things, you know? Virtual recorder. If you did not download these apps when I told you, you know, that you had to to save this device, then you will never find this app ever again. Boom, bye, bye. Boom, bye, bye. Yeah. I think somewhere here you should be able to set the settings. Hey, but this is nice, man. Look at this. Look at this. This is just beautiful. You can make nice recordings with this. 
just hook it up and the thing will record for you works and that's it effect uh, for the blackberry playbook uh, for me yeah it still works everything that i was doing with it still works i have no problem only some apps don't the same digital broadcasting also Oh, stream is offline. Yeah, you know, I found out that um, with my set 10, I can just make, how you say that, um, links to my desktop. That's what we can do in Android as well. And then you have a sort of web app. A direct link to the, to the system. So let's take a look at the camera. I always loved this device because of its camera. This thing, at the time I had the iPhone 4 or so, for 4S or even the 6, but I could never record selfies. I could never record selfies in, in 1080p. This thing could already. We're now at this point recording in 1080p so this is really nice don't you think look at that good recording quality man i can make complete reviews uh, uh youtube reviews with this device that you see there so yeah it's on black but not as black as they say you know at least not to me to me this thing is, is not on black it works fine here's my video let's take a look at it we're now at this point recording in 1080p look at that quality man so this is really nice don't you think look at that Good recording quality, man. I can make complete reviews, uh, uh, YouTube reviews with this device that you see there. So, yeah, it's on black, but... But not that black. That last part was not recorded. So before you hit stop, you must leave some seconds at the end. Bing Maps. So yeah, now we're gonna go and take a look at my uh, beloved Z10 that played music for me whole night long because it still works good. These are songs that I downloaded last night. That is uh, some reggae music, but this is uh, yeah, effect my set ten. I can search for music. Still, let's say um, culture, Joseph Hill or so. Joseph. Joseph Hill, Culture. Hey. I just saw him. Joseph. Were you there? Yesterday I played you, no man. Okay. Let's try Bob Marley. This 
Damien Marley. Oh, look at all these songs. For, ah, yeah, all these songs you can download, eh? Baby. All I know is I'm here today. I'm helping. In another day, like gun battle, two years from up. You got so this bedtime stories. One phone's like them, them Chuck Norris. I don't know the. <laughs> but hey. I'm showing you these things, but if you don't have this app, <laughs> no, I'm laughing. Who's laughing now? Who is laughing now? You know, last year when I told many of you to do these updates, to, to, to start installing these applications because, you know, when it's going to be over, you won't be able to get these applications anymore. And uh, as you can see, they still work. I have an amazing recorder here, the Parrot. Uh, with this with this uh, application you can make amazing recordings high quality hey get out man get out settings recording options equalizer notifications let me see recording options quality good high aac i would go for the top one Microphone channel, stereo, this thing can make stereo recordings. Is it? <laughs> hey, people, what, what is wrong with you? This is an amazing device for those that still have it. If, if you're going to sell it or give it away, give it to someone that is creative. But, in fact, if you don't have no apps on it, yeah, it makes no sense. Because you won't be able to use it anymore. This is a direct shortcut to uh, to radio stations here in the Netherlands. It's just a website. I link to it. And uh, it plays out of the box. You see that? The news, NPO1. Ja, precies. Dus het is niet dat ze pas op 31 december dit salaris mogen verdienen, maar dat, dat de rest ook misschien ietsje meer gaat verdienen. Precies. All place. Nice. Nice song. Dangerous song to play. Jeff. What's wrong with you peeps? When something sometimes when things go on black, they get they got even better. Even better. This thing wants me to put on location. Get out of here, man. Nonsense. SoundCloud. I downloaded at that time. You know, um, Things like YouTube, YouTube work. It's unbelievable. I don't know how they did it, but well, certain videos cannot be played. And these seem to be a whole lot sometimes. Yesterday I was trying and then say this video cannot be played. I want it that way. Tell me why. This, what is this advertisement? So yeah, no, it was not advertisement. It was the video? So certain videos play, but certain don't play. Deze gaat open. But no, I think they all play now. These are Dutch YouTubers. Okay, so, yeah. Um, you can as well install Android applications, you know. 
Uh, for instance, uh, let me see. This is an Android application, Xia. This very old application, but it still lives. And uh, you can look for music or you can play music. It will play music from, you know, um, for instance, if you look for Bob Marley, it will find the reggae station. So certain things are a little bit different, but if you if you get if you get get to understand how the system works, then it's gonna be just amazing. Stop. Okay. So as you can see, it works better than expected, and great to know is that our live tv will work we will need to give an exception to the website oh no not this website this one oh yeah that one as well no that one was not working i cannot remember let's take a look again um what i know works is us tv works so you can have this thing which you to watch TV. Plays fine. And if you like the app, the website, you we just say... Um, in other words, talk about this in advance so you're not panicking and start screen when there is and then a boom. wave or something like this. Again, more meat on the bones here. You, you see that? You so now, now you created a little app for yourself. It's not really an app, but... Here, now, you have your STV app. <laughs> so the only thing you have to do is, boom, you click it, and it will immediately bring you to there, and it will start playing your CNN for you. Is that not amazing? So yeah, even though this device is black, and it went on black, it's fully back. If you still have the device, and you can still get in, etc., and... Um, everything still works fine then you can install applications via android you can install android apps on here but you must find apps for jelly bean i think it is so somebody should create a jelly bean uh, app store app store with 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 yeah does it have to be too many apps but good apps from the past you know Good apps, good music players, good good radio radio players that still work, um, good uh, recording apps, or you know, name it. There's a complete world uh, out there for for this device now that it went on black. We should uh, now take that advantage and and um, yeah, do amazing things. I'm gonna create some nice Android. Uh, uh, Android Blackberry ROMs, but Android 11 and Android 12, but then, you know, Blackberry styled. I started, but I did not finish it yet for the Note 3. So that when Blackberry next year comes with the Android phone, they're gonna, you know, get inspiration out of that as well. They will have to create it even more beautiful than what I will show. And that's how we can as well help to keep BlackBerry alive. This will be replaced for a BlackBerry boot animation. I gladly still have it. It's, it's nowhere to be found anymore on the complete internet. But I have it from the past. And I will be able to use it. So this, this should be then uh, the BlackBerry uh, home screen. You see that? With the Google launcher or Google search, but of course, a nice clock. You see, fully in the style of BlackBerry. And that is how I think that the BlackBerry phones should come. Not what they show now. It looks awful. The design there at BlackBerry is totally lost. The guy that did the designing for the for the BlackBerry uh, OS 10, he must come back. They must get that guy back. And he must just continue the work on this what we had in OS 10 that is the 
the trademark of, of, of BlackBerry. Any other icon that will be used for a browser is, is, is terrible because it's not BlackBerry. If you're going to use another icon for the gallery, it's, it's, it's not good. It must be that icon. Messaging icon should be this one and nothing else than this. And the phone icon should be that one here. Nothing else than that. Or even more in the style of, you know. But that's how it should be. The Aurora store. It's not connected to the internet, but, you know. That's how I see that, that, that the future for, for BlackBerry. Not with these ridiculous icons that they have now in these... Uh, by the way, that was not even BlackBerry. They made BlackBerry phones, but in fact, they, they, that was not BlackBerry themselves. This is what you see in front of you here. This is original BlackBerry. And as well, the, the, the ROM that I just showed, what the thing went off. Where are you? Hey. The by the roomy. Come on, okay. Oh, there's enough. I thought it went to sleep. It was on camera. So yeah, um, even though it went on black, if you prepared as I uh, uh, told you to do uh, last year and the year before that the last year, I as well, you know, made a, a video about that, that you should get the apps that you want to keep, especially apps that can do things, recorders, uh, you know, players, some radio stations uh, get music free. Yeah, I can get music free with this thing, completely free. And as well, as well with this one, right? With the Q music playlist, was it not? What is this? Oh, this is something else. Is this still working? Yeah, man. Wow. I don't know about your device, but my device is gonna work forever. Maybe it will even live longer than me. And it will keep work. In, in 10 years from now, I'm gonna show you the same device right here on YouTube if the Almighty will let me. Beautiful. So as a simple device, it will keep working. Uh, but yeah, you had to prepare. You had to prepare, you know, prepare. If you don't prepare for the future, in the future, won't you won't have anything. You're gonna suffer. You're gonna lose good things. Yeah, this, this, this app, it's a BlackBerry app. It still works. Please, non-stop So this I can connect to, to my amplifier to play music all day by these guys. Comes out of the BlackBerry store. Amazing radio, still works. Blackberry went down, but they did, they did, they don't go down. They would be crazy to go down. Why should they go down? Not because Blackberry is closing the, the, how you say that, the service that they would having for this phone. All the apps will do that. No, the apps will just keep working. Only some apps, you know, maybe some apps that were made by Blackberry themselves, those will not work. Except then for the offline uh, applications that uh, that will always work, you know, such as your music player, your camera, your phone. You know, it would be ridiculous uh, if, if it would be ridiculous if your phone would stop working. You know, so you can still make phone calls. I think with with your BlackBerry, only the yeah some some things will not work. The messaging service from them will not work, but your SMS service will work fine, because that is not from, from BlackBerry. 
that is from the phone, to say it this way. Beautiful. <clears throat> so if you still have this device, um, you don't have to throw it away. I don't know if there are other ways uh, how you can get BlackBerry apps still, um, but with um, some browsing on the APK store that I just short linked uh, to my desktop, everything can be found still, um, but you will need jelly bean versions to make it work so if somebody can you know uh, yeah make a website with all jelly bean apps categorized like this including the easy download download link no ads and and things yeah you can put the ad on top but not annoying click here and click there and click there you know nothing like that so yeah that is it peeps I don't think I have to make this video any longer. The Blackberry is still, yeah, it's still what it is. Still works good. Uh, I have no complaints. Only problem is that with your playbook, you will every time get this pop up. And uh, it doesn't matter if you were connected before or not. Uh, yeah, it doesn't matter if you're gonna know the password or not. If you want to log in, it will say, check your internet connection, blah, blah, blah. So this literally means, yeah, that we cannot remove this, this pop-up. Yeah, it's impossible to remove it. Um, it as well means that it's very annoying. It, it will pop up every time in the screen. Uh, so I don't know if BlackBerry can do something about that to let the user still not you know use um the device in an annoyed way because blackberry yeah you are a nice company okay so please do that for me okay my friends please do that for me so we can still get rid of that message and use the device for what for what it is or um yeah open a server so people can still uh, uh, sign their device just like my you know my beautiful Black blackberry it was working last night and it went updating out of itself blackberry i did not update it i did not say update it it went updating uh, and that is not okay so that's why i think you you should as well fix it again please if you can okay help me out and i will as well help you out all right my friends so uh, that is it for uh, the classic and for the set 10 and for the playbook and even i don't know what this device is i forgot the name but it works that one is not updating so i still have uh one two three four working blackberry devices five including the other broken tablet with a broken port that effect still works thanks to this beautiful cradle so if you have a blackberry playbook and it has a problem get a cradle like this oops get a cradle like this and then you're gonna be good to go okay boom and here you can see that it's charging oh i must just move it around a little bit like this yeah how did i do that Hmm. Suddenly not charging anymore. Oh, now it's charging. I must push it to the right or to the left. So yeah, that's it, peeps. Back to the studio. That is it for my BlackBerry devices. If you still have the Z10 or any uh, BB10 OS phone, I think you can still get by with some Android apps and you can then even get your old blackberry if you can still get in uh, to play tv for you in bed or whatsoever these things they feel amazing they have the same rubber bag that at a certain moment starts melting but you can see the one from blackberry is from a better quality or probably this thing was always used in a cool environment 
So that was it. Uh, yeah, my friends, uh, I, uh, my next video is about Agave OS 32-bit, the Ubuntu 22.04 32-bit that does not exist. So that will be in the next video. So I hope you're going to tune in as well again and check it out. And then for now, I want to wish you a pleasant evening and thank you for being in the chat and I hope you enjoyed this long Blackberry video again. Bye -bye.